hello everyone welcome back to the next video in this video i will show you how to drastically reduce your android app size in expo react native so let's get started so first i'll uh, tell you how to create a expo react native project uh, because we need to create a native android module as well the native android folder to reduce the application size otherwise we won't be able to do it if you are using expo go so here uh, I will be using this blank TypeScript template, but feel free to use whatever template you want. Uh, it doesn't really matter. So I will just so this is how you can create a use a project using blank TypeScript template. So I will just paste this particular command. Now it will ask me for my app name. So I will just give it as my app. Let's just wait for a second over here. I'll click on enter and let it create the project for us then uh, to cre uh, create the native android folder you will have to go to this particular url over here you will have to select android device you will have to select development build and i have disabled es because i want to build it locally then ch choose your own operating system i'm on mac os so i have already installed watchman i have already installed this cas zulu i have set the java home path as well i have already installed android studio as well so yeah you will have to do all the steps so i have already done this i have already done all this stuff as well and i have already done this stuff as well then we need to copy this particular command and let's just wait for this to finish installing the node modules inside of our project so once this is done i can just cd to my app and then paste this particular command so again it will install few dependencies after that we need to run this command so i'll just copy it so let's just wait and i'll paste it over here uh, now it will actually create the android folder for us so if i show it to you i'll just remove this cheat sheet which i had created and uh, this is our app right so i'll just open this app and here you can see it has created the android folder for us in the very end it uh, so for me it will give an error i mean it is not really an error it is trying to find an android device or an emulator i don't have an android emulator installed i have not connected my android device to my laptop yet that's why but in your case it will show you one of the android emulators or device and ask you to run on it don't run it i mean if you want you can run it uh, it's just a basic expo react native application not much change over here so yeah that's it now let's see how to uh, reduce the application size okay so what you need to do is just go to this android folder go to app go to build.gradle just scroll down and here you need to add two things so you will see this minify minified minify enabled by default you will see something like this so i have just commented this out because by default this value is false so just comment this particular part out and just use minify enabled as true and here you have to use shrink resources as true so these two things will drastically reduce your android application size uh, that's guaranteed also some other things which you can um, make sure is instead of using you can either compress your images if you are using uh, like bundling images with your application or use something called webp images uh, like just like you have jpeg image you can convert jpeg or png to webp images uh, so yeah that's that's the other thing you can do uh, to compress your android application size but yeah these two are very important just make minify enable as true and shrink resources as true now there is one minor issue with this uh, the issue is suppose uh, i'm i have installed a dependency like i'm just giving you an example uh, like a react native keychain inside my expo react native application now whenever you install a third party dependency in their documentation they might have given you some pro guard rules so you will have to go to this proguard rules dot profile and you will uh, they will uh, tell you something like this keep class com dot react native keychain i'm just giving you an example it might be present in their documentation i have tried looking it was it used to be present in the react native keychain documentation but i'm not able to unfortunately find it because if you don't write that proguard rules over here for any third party dependencies which you have add adding and that third party dependency have native code involved so most probably they will tell you to keep uh, to add something like this so it is already there in their documentation you just have to go through their documentation for any third party libraries which you are using so here you can see they have added it for reanimated which is by default present when you create an expo react native application these things might change in the future so yeah just uh, 
um, yeah, don't worry too much about it but yeah because once you and, and this things mini fan enable shrink resources here you can see we are only doing it for the release mode we are not doing it for debug mode so some of you might wonder that okay my i don't need so some of you might just do these two steps run your application and uh, think that okay everything is working fine i don't need to add pro guard rules but like i mentioned these two are only applicable in release mode so you have to create a release apk and test your application to check whether pro guard rules are required or not so yeah next you can just create a release apk typically if you are deploying it to apple sorry google play store do not create a release apk uh, like it no longer accepts it it you have you will have to create an app bundle so yeah you can just refer the uh, expo react native documentation or uh, open android studio to create a app bundle app bundle uses a concept of split apk so it already reduces your apk size but with the help of these two things it will reduce your apk size even more so yeah that's what uh, this tutorial is all about uh, that's how simple it is to reduce your android application size even more uh, yeah that's it thank you for watching bye